Hi guys, welcome back to iPhotography. We are suitably socially distant today in the great outdoors and we've come to try out a little bit of a quirky challenge. So we've got myself, Stephen. Martin. Nick. I'm Rebecca and the lovely Maisie. So what we're gonna to do today is try out a bit of a challenge where myself and Martin are gonna be taking some photographs on our cameras. Nick and Rebecca are gonna be using their phones. And the idea behind today's kind of quirky little shoot is that what we're gonna try and demonstrate is that sometimes there isn't a massive difference between using your phone and your camera in terms of quality of shot. So the kind of challenges are is that we'll have a few different compositions that we all work towards. It's up to us as to how we shoot and then down to you guys to kind of choose out the best photographs as whether it's on the camera or it's on the phones. So for our first challenge we're going to use the lovely Maisie with these nicely shaded trees. We're all going to take some photographs of her and let's see how they turn out. So, I think this up here is absolutely beautiful. You've got nature in two forms. You've got the harsh separations of the rock, and then you've got the intertwining roots just working their way through. I think it's really interesting. I might try and get a picture of that. So we've come to this bridge in Farndon over a lovely river, which is where we're going to compose our next shot. So let's see what we all come up with. Okay, so for our final shoot, we're going to head into the churchyard here in Farndon. Churchyards are always really atmospheric, obviously, but you need to be obviously a little bit respectful. You don't want to be, you know, jumping on people's graves and stuff like that. Uh, but there's always really interesting, th this beautiful old yew tree, yew tree. They always have these yew trees in churchyards that have always got amazing kind of structures and bark, lovely old gravestones, beautiful architecture in the church. So there's a lot of subjects here for us to photograph. I hope you enjoyed the video guys. Here are the images again, and this is the reveal on who took them. How many did you get right? 